Hello! In this video I'll show you how to set up a proxy in the Firefox browser, so that when you will be working on resources with different accounts, you can hide your real IP, leave no traces when working on the Internet and ensure your anonymity. Everything is quite simple and now I will show you step by step how to do it. Launch Firefox. In the upper right corner click on Application menu. In the menu that opens you need to select Settings. Scroll down to Network Settings. You need to configure how Firefox connects to the Internet. Click Settings. By default you have no proxy selected, which means that the browser does not use a proxy. In the order to use a proxy and set it, you need to select Manual Proxy Configuration. When you select this section, the field for entering a proxy becomes active. Three active fields for entering proxies for different protocols. The first field is for the HTTP protocol. The second field is for the HTTPS protocol, but you can also use an HTTP proxy for the HTTPS protocol if you enable also use this proxy for HTTPS. In this case, both HTTP and HTTPS will use proxy which you will enter in the first field. Third field for SOX4 and SOX5 protocols. Which protocol you got, you can choose below from the field for entering a proxy. I will show you now how to enter a proxy. I have an HTTP proxy. In the first field, I am entering IP of my proxy and in the second, port of my proxy. Below, in the No Proxy 4 section, you can enter exceptions as shown in the example below for those resources or addresses on which you do not need to use a proxy. When everything is entered, click on OK. If you have a free proxy, then nothing else is needed. You will immediately be able to work on resources through a browser with a configured proxy. And if you have a personal proxy, then when you go to the resources, the browser will ask for login and password for your proxy. Enter and work. But you should remember that using a proxy directly through the browser cannot always guarantee a stable and secure work. Because some resources, especially where you need to work with multi-accounting, have learned how to block such attempts to work through a browser with a proxy. Therefore, using a proxy directly by entering, as I have shown, may not always mean safe work. But there is a solution that will allow you to avoid such blocking when working with Firefox and also allow you to work with multi-account anonymously and securely, namely the extension from the resources proxies I.O. Proxy Control. How to install it and set up a proxy I will show you now. Again, in the upper right corner click on Application menu. You need the Add-ons and Theme section. In the window that opens on the left select the Extension tab. In the search box enter Proxy Control and in the window that opens you can install the extension in the Firefox browser. Do it. When the extension is installed, an icon with the Proxy Control extension appears in the upper right corner. Press it. A window opens in which you can select a proxy if it was previously added, enable or disable the proxy or go to Settings. Since I haven't set up any proxies in the extension yet, I will click Go to Settings, which I recommend you to do in order to add your proxy. There are three ways to add a proxy quick and standard, and you can also add a new proxy by AP key. But today we will consider the first ways to add a proxy. The first way is standard. You can see four fields for adding a proxy. In the first, enter the IP of your proxy. In the second port. In the third and fourth fields, enter the login and password of your proxy, if you have a personal one. Or leave these two fields blank if you have a public proxy. When everything is entered, click Add new proxy. As you can see at the top, a proxy which you just entered. In this way you can set up as many proxies as you need. Now let's consider the second way to set up a proxy. Fast. On the right, you can see one line and an example in what format to set the proxy. Enter IP colon port of the proxy if it is a public proxy. And if it is a personal one, then IP colon port add login colon password. When everything is entered, click add new proxy. As you can see, your proxy appeared at the top. To see all proxies which you have entered in the extension at the top, click on list of proxies and you will see the proxy that you entered. Close the extension. Now at the top right, by clicking on the extension, you will see which proxy you are currently using. 
and when you have set up several proxies, select the one you need, as well as disable the proxy if you no longer need to use it. I will also remind you that for the reliable operation it is recommended to purchase a personal proxy. You can purchase a personal proxy for the Firefox browser on the proxies I.O. The support service will help you to choose the right proxy for your tasks as well as provide round-the-clock support. With such proxy your work on the network will be guaranteed anonymously and secure. That's all for now. Don't forget to click like and subscribe to the channel. Bye.